Welcome back everybody to Life of the Hammock. Today um, I finished setting up the house. It's all done. Bedding's in there. Food. Um, the feeders are in there. The water's been set up. The nest bean boxes have been set up. I'm just going to let the chickens in for the first time. So this is the grand opening for our chickens. Literally. So, let's see how they actually like it. So, I'm just going to spread some around and let them enjoy their home. So, inside here, we've got the water feeder. Everything's going to become automatic slowly. I held back because I wanted to make videos for you all. But, here's our rooster, Bobby. Rooster. Come on. Let's get him out. So they're gonna scratch around. I'm gonna encourage them to check out their house. And hopefully I'll leave this running for a bit. I want them also to come up here and hopefully check out their new home. So I'm gonna encourage them to come up on here. As you can see, I want them using their new house. Perfect. Alright. So. Close this door. Make sure that that's the extra wrap. I may actually cut this door and move the hinge up a little bit. It won't be too bad. And then put another beam across so when I open it, it all matches. That's something I didn't think about. But it's not a big deal, something that can be easily fixed. Alright, I'm just going to grab the camera so you can see everything. This is the good thing about this. They've got plenty of space now, compared to before. And this is the official move in, hopefully. Just need to see if that's high enough for them to drink off. If not, I just, I'm just going to bring it down a little bit. Seems like they're having fun. I can't wait to see them use this, and then go up into there. So then they can come and have a look at their house. Alright, looks like Bobby can get to there no problem. Bobby can get to there no problem. It's just a tad bit high. So I might bring that down. They'll struggle. So I'm going to do a semi deep layer. It's supposed to be about a foot. It's just under a foot. Um, hi, so what I will be doing is seeing how a deep litter works here So then I've got because we've got busy lifestyles um, However, it's still something that I want to do. They provide us fresh eggs every day um, He's got a little bit of soggy bottom, but nothing that can't be fixed with a little bit of water. He's been eating a bit unhealthy lately There we go Hopefully we can get them to use this Maybe I should have scared it up there first. So let them enjoy it. The rest has gone into the chicken house, as you can see. I'm just recording through the nest box for you all. I to put some corn there. But you managed to get in. So, Hopefully he likes it. 
This is going to be his kingdom. This is ladies. Down there. We're still eating and doing what they want to do. I guess he's the one who explores first. He's the one who protects them. And then checks if everything's alright. Say hello, Bobby. My wife named him Bobby, by the way. Looks like they've got settled in pretty well. In terms of Bobby, <laughs> no, it doesn't seem like Bobby knows how to get out. All the other chickens get out. It looks like Bobby is struggling a little bit. He should be able to just get up. Come on, don't. I can tell. Go to this one. See that? Here's what it looks like under here. They seem pretty really happy. They're going to scratch around and they're going to actually explore this whole place. And Bobby's very protective, very protective. But because I raised him from an egg, and she ha he hatched out, he's uh, okay with me. Um, that's the dust buff. It's got a mixture of sand cement and some diatomaceous earth. Not sand cement, sorry. Um, this is how you know I've been building too much <laughs> sand. Uh, some earth and some diatomaceous earth. Oh, can they? Let's see. Can you reach? She did seem to reach. I put a brick under there, by the way. I don't know if you can see it to help them get up. But once they're up here, she should be able to reach. Please remember to like, subscribe and hit the notification bell and I'll continue to make more videos for you and let me know if you want me to set up a camera in here so I can do some just like recordings and you can see different shots of them. Alright everybody, thank you for watching and catch you on the next one.